Finally, finally we have fire trucks. We have some sort of vehicle to fight some fires. Thank you so much, Lambo. Lambo was able to make this for us. He just sent it to me a few days and I was able to get a video up on it. But guys, check it out. We got a fire truck. Insane engine 44. 44. I like I like the number 44. Four is my favorite number, and when I got two of them, even better. So check it out. We jumped in. It's a it's a registered Ford, I guess. I, I guess I never really paid attention to like actually what fire trucks are i'm sure there's every a lot of people know uh better than i do so let's go ahead let's go over the controls left to right oh oh cool uh so if i okay um okay so that's how you turn the siren on you left click and then you drag very cool so we have sirens we have a light we put on the chrome wheels. There's another option for like uh, for like black wheels. So we can also fill this guy up. And then there's hand tools. And I believe Lambo said that we could spray with them. But I downloaded it, put it in, and I couldn't find it. Um, probably because I have too many mods and I just kept scrolling past it or something. But I couldn't find it. Not too big a deal. We're pretty much going to be showing off the station here. So there is the fire. Er, all right. Oh, very cool. So we have another. Oh, I like that. Cool camera right there. All right. Just missed my turn. Not too bad. So we have our refilling station. The this is Lambo's. This is Lambo created this fire station. It's for filling up the fire trucks. And I think you can store them. I still need to put cement down. But then we also have that fire station, which has been around for a while. And I really, really like it. Super clean, cool stalls. Let's go ahead, pull in. Authorized vehicles only. That's us, boys. That's us. I've waited for this moment for so long. And then Seasons is out. As of the recording of this episode, Seasons is out. I'm kind of busy right now with uh, with other things and other series. I will have a proper snow video coming out soon, hopefully. So be on the lookout for that. All right, there we go. Open up the door, baby. That's cool. Cool window up there. All right, so walking in, we got our workbench, we got all of our gear, first aids, oil, probably for chainsaws, mask, more first aid, just everything, a jack. Oh, look at that fire extinguisher, perfect. All right, coming over here, even more tools, more equipment, and then, okay, so here's our water tank. I believe we can fill up here. It's where we're going to fill up. Can I open up this side too? There we go. There we go. So this is the first time I've ever seen this. What is this? A lift? Okay, so that's a lift. How high does it go up? Hmm. I wonder what you would put in there. Oh, huh, that's interesting. Very interesting. I don't know what you would put in there, but it could easily be like a really cool storage device too. A little elevator there. So we got a ladder going up there. Security cameras. Here we go. I think this is the official front door into the help desk or like the lounge area. Got some cool pictures here. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. So they used to do in the olden days. A little, little wagon there with some water on there. Yeah, this is super good. So thank you so much, Lambo. Guys, make sure you go check him out. Uh, I believe I have his link in the description. There's the Jaws of Life. And then, yeah, very. Oh, that's a cool picture. Let's keep going around here very cool very cool very cool i'm just kind of fire station history built during world war ii deep in the foothills of washington state combined effort between u.s army rangers and local fireland oh so this okay so fireland fire teams to secure the coastline in the event of a coastal attack so was over is quickly converted to a local fire department and wildland land fire depot being able to house over 70 staff to provide on-site power for the dorms. So this is, so there's a little history behind this. That's why he named it Wildland. He actually had a thought behind it. There we go. And, and they're in our ship. Oh, we got Netflix playing too. There we go. Very cool. Very cool. So we have our lounge here where the, you know, the fire firemen can take breaks and all that good stuff when they are like in between shifts or something. Where are the beds? Sure, they have, they have to have beds in here. Oops, we stuck on the table. There we go. All right, then this is where we can come around, maybe. 
Oh, there's a fire pole. Let's go. Okay. Oh, wait. There's a third floor. All right. I'm sorry. Okay. That's how you get. Oh. All right. So let's go up to the third floor. Okay. This is where everybody sleeps. I was going to say there has to be something like this. Holy cow. That's so many. Even a ladder up here. Okay. So there's the window. Even more kind of lounge area in there. Very cool. This place is way bigger on the inside than it looks on the outside. We'll jump down the fire pole. So cool. And then here we are. So let me know what you guys think of this. Lambo did such a good job. And that's going to be our... Here, let's go ahead and refill the truck. Get her ready to go. We'll go ahead and pull in here. The two, It says first you need to fill the tool. So obviously we can fill it up with water. We'll come pull in here. I wonder how much it holds. All right. Can I refill it? Oops. Okay. Maybe I have to... Okay, I have to zoom in a lot. Maybe I have to pull in on the other side? Today's fire danger. Extreme. Extreme fire danger. All right, that's not good. We might have to fight some fires, boys. Oh. There we go. Pull her in. But let me know what you guys think of the, of the fire engine. I think it's... It's awesome. It's super cool. We've been waiting for this in a really cool fire station, too. There's so many little detail things. All right, so it's not letting me fill it up. You would assume... Here, let's just drive around. You'd assume that's where we, you would fill up, but there might be something around that I'm just not looking at. All right, let's pull around to the front. We'll see if we can see anything, but very cool. It's very, it, it gives you the cabin kind of feel and it's so big up top there. All right, so that looks like you would fill up there. Anything else? A little cool American flag up there too. Huh. All right, a little confused on why it's not filling up. Maybe, I really don't know. I really don't know, guys. Let me know if, hopefully I can get this figured out. Maybe the water. Okay, let's make sure we have our control open in case. All right, let's 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 think about this. Where would you fill up with the fire truck? Would you fill up on this side? I right, know obvious signs of any filling up side. Would it be, I mean, there's our leader number right there. Is there one over here? Nope. So I'm leaning towards on the driver's side. And then, hmm. Confused, confused, confused. I know, you should be able to fill this up. Come on now, baby. So I'm thinking the problem is, is that I don't have the hand tool in game right now i actually i like i said i couldn't find it and i wasn't going to i didn't think it was that big a deal because we still don't have fire like the fire placeable in game just yet and when we do then i'm gonna need my fire tool to take it out and you guys will know when that happens uh but just right now i think if you guys check out garrett plays video he was using it if you're really interested in that and i think that's why it's not letting me fill up properly okay we can't back up on this there we go and so I, I'm, my guess is I can't fill it properly because of that. So what I want to do now is I'm going to get like three to four more fire engines because this place is going to be servicing other counties as well. Uh, some smaller ones. So we need to have a lot always just, you know, of course, like just in case. So here it is. It's a fire truck Ford C type. Let's see. It has 650 horsepower. Um... Holds 200,000 liters. Uh, the Ford C series is a range of trucks that are assembled by Ford between the 57 and 90, used as a basis for fire protection. There we go. So, what we want to do, we'll switch it out. So, we got chrome wheels on the last one. We'll get mayhem wheels. I want to see how these look. We'll get that. Then, we'll get another chrome. And then, we'll get another mayhem. So, we'll have, what is that? I think five. I think I just spent like a million dollars on fire trucks. We'll have four. There we go. So there's the mayhem. Oh, they look pretty good. I like the red like stripes. It it matches perfectly. Should I should I throw my lights on and put the sirens on? Oh yeah, by the way, there's the military base too. We're on the same map of the military base, which is I just oh There we go. 
Get these guys out of my way. Move it or lose it, sisters. Oh, you just honked at me? All right, so there's the sirens. Don't want to hurt you guys' ears too much. There's really no, like, medium or, like, low setting, which would kind of be nice, but I'm not too picky. Um, so we'll go ahead, pull in here. I'll throw one more in this guy, then two more in the other station. I just got two because, uh, I don't know. I, I like the other one, too, in terms of, like, housing our fire trucks. Obviously, we need this one to fill up with water and all that cool stuff. And if you guys want to check out this mod, you guys can join Lambo's Patreon. But other than that, it will be public in about a month. I don't, I don't have all the information, but it's just, I know it's not public right now. So, if that makes sense. Uh, if you guys are familiar with it, if you, you, it'll all become public. But if you would like to have like his mods that come out, uh, his like monthly mod pack. If you guys want to get those a month early, you can. Uh, by joining his Patreon, I think it's super cheap, like five bucks or something. So, make sure you go help him out because he makes some of the best mods in the game. Like this dope fire truck, baby. Oh, there we go. All right, move it or lose it. Get out of the way, baby. Get out of the way. Oh, no. What am I doing? No. No, what did I just do? What a nerd. There we go. All right, we're cut free. What was that? I don't know. I thought the turn was right there or something. Let's go ahead and hang a right. Let's whip her in. I still need to do a little bit of sculpting. I'm not going to go too crazy. What? Yeah, shut off. All right, I'm not going to go too crazy with it. Don't think I really need to. Go ahead and crack all these doors open. One more. Hallelujah, hallelujah. So I think that's fire station in another language. Kind of interesting. We'll go ahead and back it up here. And the ladders don't work on any of these things, but great, great trucks. They seem to run very well. And we do have the hand tool. It's a little different than uh, 17. And I think it's, in my opinion, a little more realistic. There we go. We'll go ahead and grab the last one. Driver on down. And today's episode is going to be a bit shorter. Again, we do not have fire in game when we do we're gonna be fighting some fires it's gonna be crazy it's gonna be intense and it'll be a lot of fun move it or lose it sister watch out we're making moves move it or lose it baby these things are pretty pretty good at controlling too so that's pretty exciting i always hated the ones that took like 10 minutes to wind up if you guys remember if if you uh watched our videos in 17 it was so bad it took like 20 minutes for it to get 60 miles an hour there we go she lights off she's in boys she is in if you haven't seen this one pretty bland but still a pretty cool station i like the um the loading bay i think it's very traditional very oh the door's open there's a conference meeting that's where we fire our employees no i'm kidding what kind of probably I think this is oh yeah this is a control panel is where we call them in we're like get your butt in there you need to head down south or something and then let's go ahead and just do a little bit of sculpting not much just what do we want do i want that should we do something cool all right maybe we'll just keep it the same as the like foundation of it go ahead pull in Pull in right there. We should probably make like these together. That would only make sense. Oh, probably should make this a bit smaller. There we go. And then you kind of like pull in there. There we are. Yeah, so not much. Don't want to do too much. Uh, just kind of want to almost just throw it together and be done with it because sometimes I do a little too much. A little too much sculpting, a little too much kind of sculpting work. Sometimes it just isn't worth it. And we don't want to spend any more money than we got to. And nice big turnout there. Looks good. I mean, we can throw a little bit of trees down, but that's pretty much it. Say hello to the fire trucks. You're going to be getting to know them. Once we get the fire out, it's going to be very exciting. We'll place it down. We'll go to fires. I mean, it'll be insane. 
and it'll be really fun. So please hit the like button if you guys are enjoying Spencer TV channel. We're on our way to 200,000. If you haven't subscribed, please do, man. I get so mad when nobody subscribes. Mr. Chow is just upset. There's not no, I'm kidding. Uh, Mr. Chow will be back here soon. We're getting him started on his uh, his dealership. We're teaching him how to deal with customers. So be excited for that because we bought Roll Cole Customs, and he's gonna be the uh, the like owner or like the the manager of it. So that'll be fun. So thank you guys all so much for watching, and I'll see y'all on the next one.